who needs some more R&R? &R? Let's go for another Rehouse Ravio. Right guys, so as I said in the intro, we're going to be doing another Rehouse. We're going to be doing another review. Today's review is going to be on the Tropical Forest Floor. Um, two in one dual layered. I'm not going to lie, I don't already don't like the look of this for the cool fact that if you have a look, cocoa husk fiber. So I want to go away from cocoa fiber, but I did say I would review different things, so I will give this a review. I'm hoping this keeps some moisture out of it. And the rehouse will be for this little one who kind of needs a new home one because this one's terrible, but also. I want it to feel safer, so I wanted to give it somewhere to hide in, like most pokies do. This is the Postotheria um, Fasciata. So, let's get into this, let's rehouse it. Come on. Alright, so this is going to be the plan. We're going to try Catch Cup Liss to get the pokey from this little enclosure to its big enclosure. See, we get on. Sorry for your only background noise, it is absolutely hammering down at the moment. So, come on, is it gonna come out? Is this gonna be easy? Come on, not bitey, which is always a good thing. Oh, oh no. Then I'll knock this enclosure over with a straw. Why not? Come on. It's no wrong way. You were going the wrong way. No, wrong home. Are you too good for your home? And there we go. And in. Well, let's see if we can get a better shot for you. Probably not. It's probably gone straight down. I think it has gone straight down underneath. Oh, um... Well, that's probably about the best view I can get. I will put one in the top corner of this tarantula when it's fully grown. But as you can see, it's got nice little hidey places down in the cork bark water dish. Mm. Yep, I do prefer the look of this moss to the other moss. It actually looks like natural moss for a change. But yeah, I think it'll use both of these. It's got two holes that I can go into. I think I'll enjoy this. Let's, let's just wrap this up. What's up, Gav? What's up? No catch cup, as requested by Gav. He is going to be livid when he watches this and sees how the spider just walked from one enclosure to the other because I'm not telling him. I normally message him in, like on my last video that you would have seen with Aversi. Took a picture of it on the table and said, escapey. Just nothing I can do about it, escapey on the table. But this one, mm -hmm. how do you like that, Mr. Walker? There was a catch cup underneath the table, which I was hoping not to use, which I didn't have to use, so. Ciao! Right, let's get into the review part of this, shall we? And before that, rehouse, smooth as you can get. Fasciata, unbelievable tarantula. Um, never rehoused a pokey without a catch cup. Um, this is the first, maybe the last, depending on how aggressive and fast pokies are in the future. So let's get reviewing. This is the, oh, turn it upside down, it goes everywhere. So read it upside down, peeps. It is a tropical forest floor, two in one layer, cocoa fiber and moss. Now, firstly, we do look, as you can see, moss. It's not like the stuff you can buy in the shops, which I've got somewhere around here, which is like watered down. It looks like the colors come out of it. It's white. It's, it doesn't look as natural. Um, I don't know, I'm still in the cocoa fiber. There is, yeah, there's not much to say about that. I'm gonna do look, which I didn't do on the last video. This is what I mean by as I'm going along, I'll add extra things to it. Um, the luck of the other one, I would say, was probably what, four, maybe a five. If you check my last video, then you might see what it is. 
but yeah that was like a four stroke five um the luck of this one i'm probably going to give it a three maybe a three and a half and at least two of those are for the moss probably 2.5 is for the moss um cocoa fiber is cocoa fiber i'm not a fan of it anymore it's meant to be for tarantula bedding and stuff but if you've got a moisture dependent species you can get a lot of mold so happy with the ones i've used the first one i used this one looks good with the moss on top of it and hopefully that will suck up any moisture so that'll hopefully make the cocoa fiber null and void really more than anything um as for like moisture retention i would say this is probably a good four again all four of that is due to the moss there's quite a thick layer of moss in there as well so that should get any moisture that's in there and just suck it up so that's the good side of this substrate is the moss the cocoa fiber is cocoa fiber um as for like modeling around things and anyone who's used cocoa fiber i touched on in the last video anyone who's used cocoa fiber knows you have to soak the cocoa fiber to or not soak but get it wet so you can kind of pack it in and make it harder to hold things in place this again i had to moisten the top of the cocoa fiber which i didn't really want to do and then i soaked the uh, moss put the thing in kind of i also use one where it's not going to move much because of the width of it so that was again planned due to the fact that i'm using cocoa fiber um overall i would give this product probably three and a half and again i'm going to say two and a half is purely down to the moss if this was just cocoa fiber it would be getting a maximum of a one um if you missed the last review it will be either at the end of this video or up here or in the description or wherever i put it if i remember um before i go hopefully you all enjoyed this um if you did let me know in the comments i've still got a spider life to go but i'm not just going to rehouse the spider for the sake of rehousing the spider just so i can look at that so there will be one or two getting rehoused soon so that's when i'll look at that kind of substrate um hopefully you're enjoying this there don't forget there is another I'm trying to think what one it is now tarantula tales 12 i believe is out this week and uh, that'll be out on thursday i've still got quite a few out there ready to come back i've edited up to 13 so let's see what we get on with it again a massive thank everybody for watching sorry about the extra time on the end of this video but it's a nice short rehouse so winner everyone thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video i've been out you guys are awesome hasta la baba